of customs as we go. We've got two tributes to do for uh, Paul Maxwell. One is a more well-known character and the other one is a lesser known one. Still, I do know who that other lesser known one is so I still will do him. But yeah, give us a second and we'll get going with number two of our custom list for today. Hey guys, welcome back to LEGO DC Super Villains Custom Builds, and here we are again, another awesome exciting LEGO Custom. And today, continuing on the Customs LEGO DC Super Villains Custom Builds, is another called Stan Panama Hat from Indiana Jones. Also played by uh, Paul Maxwell, G uh, great talent he was. So inside we go. Um, if you don't know who he was in Indiana Jones, in the Last Crusade, he was the opening antagonist to uh, young Indiana Jones. Now, it, it wasn't. He wasn't Fedora, who was that guy that uh, Indy inspired to be. It was his boss in the white. That's who he played, and Paul Maxwell did. Inside we go, though, to do the uh, crime boss, uh, Panama Hat. Uh, his hat, he had the Fedora on, too, and that is the white one. I do have his uh, image up here, so bear with me. Uh, there we go. And it looks like, yeah, it seems that he has a mustache on there as well, so, custom head. Still, he looks good for his age. Uh, scroll on up, locating the right headpiece. Uh, there it is, number 38. And then going to the wrinkle section, we're just going to blend that in. Remove that away. The facial hair, I want to say, is a dark grey from the look of it. And then work your way onto the arms. These are going to be, um, I want to say, Alfred arms, but also animated series Joker arms could work too. And wipe them up. Hands, human skin, torso. Is um, Clarion with the white tie there? So locate Clarion around here somewhere. Boom, and wipe that up. Hit piece white, leg section, animated series, joker legs, white. There we go, coming on out, giving him a gun, why not? That will be a revolver, dark grey, light grey, pick one. He also claims a cane, so you can also give him that as well. Uh, red heart, standard health, voice, two, target module, mercy greys, basic speed animation, doesn't matter due to his gun, and then onto the abilities, tap square full of hiding, lunge attack two, Tap circle, detective mode, I guess, for a crime lord type of character. And then you have his rage mode, number three. Next button, single jump, skill set, scroll on down. Goon command, tracking. Goon nation stealth. And graffiti, I buy that. There we go. And there we have ourselves, Paul, Ma um, the character known as Panama Hat, which I didn't put the name in yet. So he's going to be a villain. Well, wouldn't you know these guys putting in his name, Panama Hat. And da da da. Space H A and a T. Save. Right, let's see how the chat is going. Hello, Paul. Can you make Doctor Doom from Marvel Comics? Hello, Batfan. So we go, showing off the abilities, and there is Panama Hat. Do 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 do. Right, showing off the abilities. Tap square for the gun. Hold square lunge attack. Tap circle detective mode. Hold circle rage mode. And you have his single jump as well. But there we have Panama Hat from Indiana Jones: Last Crusade. Hopefully, you guys did enjoy how it came out. If you did, smash that like button, subscribe, that good stuff. Hit notification bell, right corner down below. To stay in tune for Lego DC Super Villains custom builds and the rest of content on the channel. Coming up next on my list is none other than Captain Paul Travers from Thunderbirds 1966, another character that Paul Maxwell played, which I know about. Uh, can you? make Carmine Falcone from DC Comics, no problem. Up to date with chat. Thank you all for watching. I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace out.